For Anil Kumar, a professional typist for more than 40 years, the ribbon may finally have run out. His typewriter has helped him make a living and raise his family, but times have changed, with computers replacing these old typing machines. Income from typing jobs is down, and servicing his typewriter to keep it going costs more than what he now earns. The end of the typewriter will mean the end of my work. India still has a few thousand professional typists left, and some can be found outside New Delhi's main courthouse, here where typists can earn a few dollars a day preparing anything from rental agreements, sales contracts and other legal documents. But that barely pays for transportation, typewriter ribbons and the occasional repair job. This typewriter, the manufacturing of such typewriters has stopped. We have to rebuild parts, which are costly, and the repair charges of the mechanics have also increased. There are now only a handful of typewriter repairers and stores selling spare parts. I find it very difficult to repair typewriters. It takes about two to three days to repair a machine. If I don't find a spare part, I have to make it myself from scratch. Typewriters may be disappearing, but some computer schools are still using them for learning. Even if we don't use it in the future, we should learn on typewriters. If someone wants to learn a good typewriting and want to increase their typing speed, then learning on typewriter is a must. For many typists, the future appears dim as the country shifts towards the latest in technology. But for some, like Anil, they intend to keep their profession alive as long as they can, Ben said, TRT World.